Psalm 133, a song of ascents by David. Behold, how good and how pleasant is the dwelling of brothers, moreover, in unity, like the precious oil upon the head, running down upon the beard, the beard of Aaron, running down over his garments, so the dew of Hermon descends upon the mountains of Zion, for there Hashem has commanded the blessing. May there be life forever. Psalm 134, a song of ascents. Behold, bless Hashem, all you servants of Hashem, who stand in the house of Hashem in the nights. Lift your hands in the sanctuary and bless Hashem. May Hashem bless you from Zion, maker of heaven and earth. Psalm 135, Hallelujah, praise the name of Hashem. Praise, O you servants of Hashem. You who stand in the house of Hashem, in the courtyards of the house of our God, praise God, for Hashem is good. Sing to his name, for it is pleasant. For God selected Jacob for his own, Israel as his treasure. For I know that Hashem is greater, our Lord, than all heavenly powers. Whatever Hashem wished, he did, in heaven and on earth, and in the seas and all the depths, he raises clouds from the end of the earth. He made the lightning bolts for the rain. He brings forth wind from his treasuries. It was he who smote the firstborn of Egypt, from man to beast. He sent signs and wonders into your midst, O Egypt, upon Pharaoh and upon all his servants. It was he who smote many nations and slew mighty kings. Sihon, king of the Amorite, Og, king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan and presented their land as a heritage, a heritage for Israel, his people. Hashem, your name is forever. Hashem, your memorial is throughout the generations. When Hashem will judge his people, he will relent concerning his servants. The idols of the nations are silver and gold, human handiwork. They have mouths, but they speak not. They have eyes, but they see not. They have ears, but they hear not. Neither is there any breath in their mouths. Like them shall be their makers, like them shall their makers become, everyone who trusts in them. O house of Israel, bless Hashem. O house of Aaron, bless Hashem. O house of Levi, bless Hashem. O those who fear Hashem, bless Hashem. Blessed is Hashem from Zion, he who dwells in Jerusalem. Hallelujah. Psalm 136. Give thanks to Hashem, for He is good, for His kindness endures forever. Give thanks to the God of the heavenly powers, for His kindness endures forever. Give thanks to the Lord of the lords, for His kindness endures forever. To Him who alone performs great wonders, for His kindness endures forever. To Him who made the heavens with understanding, for His kindness endures forever. To him who spread out the earth upon the waters, for his kindness endures forever. To him who made great lights, for his kindness endures forever. The sun for the rain of the day, for his kindness endures forever. The moon and the stars for the rain of the night, for his kindness endures forever. To him who smote the Egyptians through their firstborn, for his kindness endures forever. And brought Israel forth from their midst, for his kindness endures forever. With strong hand and outstretched arm, for his kindness endures forever. To him who divided the sea of reeds into parts, for his kindness endures forever. And caused Israel to pass through it, for his kindness endures forever. And threw Pharaoh and his army into the sea of reeds, for his kindness endures forever. To him who led his people through the wilderness, for his kindness endures forever. To him who smote great kings, for his kindness endures forever. And slew mighty kings, for his kindness endures forever. Sihon, king of the Amorite, for his kindness endures forever. And Og, king of Bashan, for his kindness endures forever. And presented their land as a heritage, for his kindness endures forever. A heritage for Israel his servant, for his kindness endures forever. In our lowliness he remembered us. For his kindness endures forever. And he released us from our tormentors. For his kindness endures forever. He gives nourishment to all flesh. For his kindness endures forever. 
Give thanks to God of the heavens, for His kindness endures forever. Psalm 137 By the rivers of Babylon, there we sat and also wept when we remembered Zion. On the willows within it we hung our lyres. For there our captors requested words of song from us, with our lyres playing joyous music. Sing for us from Zion's song. How can we sing the song of Hashem upon the alien soil? If I forget you, O Jerusalem, let my right hand forget its skill. Let my tongue adhere to my palate if I fail to recall you. If I fail to elevate Jerusalem above my foremost joy, remember Hashem for the offspring of Edom, the day of Jerusalem. For those who say, destroy, destroy, to its very foundation. O violated daughter of Babylon, praiseworthy is he who repays you in accordance with the manner that you treated us. Praiseworthy is he who will clutch and dash your infants against the rock. Psalm 138 By David, I will thank you with all my heart. In the presence of princes, I will sing to you. I will prostrate myself toward your holy sanctuary, and I will thank your name for your kindness and your truth. For you have exalted your promise even beyond your name. On the day I cried, you answered me. You emboldened me. There is strength in my soul. All the kings of the earth will acknowledge you, Hashem, because they heard the words of your mouth, and they will sing the ways of Hashem. For great is the glory of Hashem. For though Hashem is exalted, he notes the lowly, and the high one makes himself known from afar. Though I walk amid distress, you preserve me. To counter the wrath of my enemies, you extend your hand, and your right hand saves me. May Hashem complete on my behalf. Hashem, your kindness is eternal. Do not let go of the creatures of your hand. Psalm 139 For the Conductor by David A Psalm O Hashem, you have scrutinized me, and you know. You know my sitting down and my rising up. You understand my thought from afar. You encompass my path and my repose. You are familiar with all my ways, for the word is not yet on my tongue. Behold, Hashem, you knew it all. Back and front, you have restricted me, and you have laid your hand upon me. Knowledge is beyond me, exalted. I am incapable of it. Where can I go from your spirit? And where can I flee from your presence? If I ascend to heaven, you are there. If I make my bed in the lowest depths, behold, you are there. Were I to take up wings of dawn, were I to dwell in the distant west, there too your hand would guide me, and your right hand would grasp me. Would I say, surely darkness will shadow me, then the night would become as light around me. Even darkness obscures not from you, and night shines like the day. Darkness and light are the same. For you have created my mind. You have covered me in my mother's womb. I acknowledge you, for I am awesomely, wondrously fashioned. Wondrous are your works, and my soul knows it well. My frame was not hidden from you. That which I was made in concealment, which I was knit together in the lowest parts of the earth. Your eyes saw my unshaped form, and in your book all were recorded. Though they will be fashioned through many days, to him they are one. To me, how glorious are your thoughts, O God! How very great are their headings! Were I to count them, they would outnumber the grains of sand, even if I were to be constantly awake and always with you. If only you would slay the wicked... O oh God, the men of blood to whom I say, Depart from me, those who pronounce your name for wicked schemes. It is taken in vain by your enemies. For indeed, those who hate you, O Hashem, I hate them, and I quarrel with those who rise up against you. With the utmost hatred I hate them. They have become enemies unto me. Examine me, O God, and know my heart. Test me and know my thoughts, and see if I have a vexing way, and lead me in the way of eternity.